Welcome to another Unturned video. Today I went on my Polaris server and we're going to do some base raids and a ton of PvP. The server is normal loot with TPA and home, but their cooldowns are extremely long, meaning that they are more than 5 minutes. This video is also a continuation of another one, and if you haven't watched that, the links will be in the description below for the previous episode. If you guys enjoyed this video and want to see more Polaris short movies, make sure to drop a like, let's aim for 500 likes. Subscribe if you haven't already, a huge percentage of you guys watching right now aren't, and I would really appreciate it. Also, last video I rolled a mythical giveaway and this is the winner. To claim your prize, please join my Discord and contact me there. Today we're going to roll another one, which is a wealthy Viking helmet. To have a chance to win this giveaway, make sure that you have liked, subscribed, and comment whatever you want below. Channel members also have a higher chance to win, and if anyone watching right now wishes to become a member, the link is in the description below, and let's get straight into the video. Alright ladies and gentlemen, it is time for me to go to a dead zone run. Now there are quite a ton of people on the server, but I do have my duo with me that he will protect me while I am actually looting the dead zone. Server is gonna restart in less than 15 seconds, so when we're back, we're gonna go straight towards the dead zone. From there I'm going to aim to get as much gunpowder as possible. Yeah, server has been shut down. There was an update, that's why it has been shut down. Alright, so I'm very close to the dead zone. Majojo can't enter. He doesn't have a gas mask. There are only four people on the server, which is why exactly we're going on right now. Since the server did just start up, people are still joining in and all of that. So we can get to do a dead zone run in peace. The server is usually having over 30 players the whole time, so doing a dead zone run is quite scary. Now all I want is just the zombies to come running out. I will shoot them down as quickly as possible. I did get myself quite a ton of ammo with me. Because eventually today I do want to start doing some base raids. We already did one but it was pretty bad. Alright, so for the first items, gun oil. Yeah, there's a lot of zombies out here. Same time we're gonna get ourselves quite a ton of XP. And hopefully these zombies will drop me some drums as well. Our armor plates, gun oil. 70mm drums. What's over here? Two gunpowder, perfect. That's one C4. Yeah, I broke my leg. Did I? Yeah, I got my med kit with me. Let's go, that's good. Well, Jojo said that he saw a guy very close. So I gotta be careful that he's not gonna try to go around me or something. Try to kill me. Alright, so I should have killed every single zombie. Alright, 7.62 magazines. Now, my Jojo did find a live base, apparently. I don't know if I should home or if I should go and help him. I do have myself quite a ton of loot. I'm gonna TP to him. It says that he's safe, so we should be okay. Now, I did get myself gun four gunpowder. Oh, yeah, I, I see him. Oh, well, I got shot. Well, he is not safe. I'm in the dead zone. Okay, I'm dead. All right, well, I cannot TP for like 10 more minutes now. Yeah, I gotta wait for... I gotta wait 270 seconds. Okay, well, I didn't even get a chance against that dude. He was on top of the roof. Majoja hopefully will kill him. Unfortunately, we did lose uh, quite a ton of items, especially the, the gas Musk more than anything, but it's okay, we will be able to get that back quite easily. Or maybe we will attempt to raid this man later on, who knows. Wait, those are legs. Bro, there's somebody in there. Alright, well, I had no idea people were gonna be here. I was just gonna check it out to see if there are any actually unraided bases, but there is an individual in this base. I don't know if it's actually built or not. I'm gonna push though. I mean, I don't really have anything that much important on me. Alright, yeah, these crates are empty. Actually, I do have a broken gas mask on me. I don't want to lose that. Alright, oh, there's a guy. Alright, uh, he was clueless. Yeah, he's stacked. Yeah, he was building a base in here. Right, he has an elite pack, full military. Scrap floor, some pillars. He has a retro snake. Yeah, I'll take all of these items, obviously. Especially the buildables. We could put those in base somewhere. He has some cans, tape. Yeah, we'll take all of this rope. He has a jackhammer too, some ammo. Oh, that was unexpected. Got full military, glasses, very nice. Yeah, there's a one by one over there, metal, I don't know, that could be his. I'm gonna go check it out very soon. Oh no, he just left the server, never mind. Alright, we are back in base after that kill, I am going to place every single item that I have gotten. Mostly I got rope though. Got rope and a couple of cans. Broken gas mask, which I think I can be able to make myself another gas mask with that. Now we got ourselves quite a ton of rope, man. Pretty soon I'm gonna go get myself some lotuses. We should be able to have uh, enough for a couple. Here we got ourselves a ton of rope. We have so much night vision in here, actually. Alright, cyan crystal. And we'll place the tape as well. You guys didn't know, tape can be placed. Now in order for us to progress, we just need gunpowder. And then we could be able to make more C4. We already have two. But obviously two, we need more to raid bigger bases. Yeah, there's another cyan crystal over here. Perfect. Two copper coil. Right, I'm gonna go and get myself two lotuses. That's pretty much 2C4, until we get the gunpowder at least. Alright, yeah, the truck is over there. Uh, the coast seems clear. Hopefully I actually didn't need to bring myself a military drive with me. Alright, copper coil, crystal. First one, copper. 
crystal and load so there we go bam yeah we need another military drive to continue that's good to know well some some here there's an observer spawn right over here i'm gonna go and kill it really quickly and they bring the rest of the snake with me all right he's dead yeah it takes like a full nine millimeter magazine to kill him it's not that much all right, i'm gonna head back to base especially since i have the lotuses with me now that base right over there on top of the mountain we might trade it later on seems like it could be a good raid and since it's made out of wood, we only need one C4. There's another base over here, which I do want to raid as well. I am not sure if this one is actually raided or not. Oh wait, I think... Oh no, it's raided. Oh, there's one gunpowder up here. Perfect. Oh yeah, this base is already raided. Oh wait, it's actually... Alright, it's partially raided. We could raid this later on then. Yeah, there are two pretty nice bases next to us. This one, and then the tower base. With this one gunpowder that we just gotten, we can make ourselves literally another C4. That's all I needed. Alright, we'll place these for now. We will we will craft the C4 later. I gotta get myself the C4 and the Detto. Right, we got them both. Now we'll TPA to my Jojo. And we will do an epic base raid. We already did one raid, but it was very bad. Right, I don't know if we should actually raid this one first, to be honest. Maybe we'll do this one later. And my Jojo is telling me it's a garage. So I believe him. That's okay, we'll go raid the other one later on. Obviously, after I will want to raid bigger bases. And ones that are far further away. Right now we're raiding smaller ones so that we're closer to base. And since we don't have that much raiding gear, we wouldn't risk it that much. Here, let's check out what this one has over here. Anything good? Bayonet. Not bad. Alright, so the area is obviously claimed. In order for us to actually raid this base, we had to build ladders far away. Majorjo did have a parachute, thankfully. I don't have one though. And since CPA cooldown is every 5 minutes, we can just abuse it all the time. Majorjo did jump up there, but he doesn't have the C4. We're going to raid through the one-way gloss because it might not take that much. Then he'll have to redo the jump. Alright, he did place the C4. Let's go all the way down. We'll claim it. Hopefully it will actually break. Uh, I don't think it did. Alright, we need to put one more C4 then. Yeah, it didn't break. Oh, I'm gonna break my leg. Okay, no. We're good. Right, I'm gonna TP8 to my Jojo. I'm gonna place the other C4 then. Alright, we'll put it right over... Bro, it's so annoying because we can't actually see it. Alright, uh, that's a good placement, that's pretty good. Now, hopefully with this one it will actually break. Alright, go back. Oh, yes sir. Oh, even lockers broke. Oh, that's really good, but... Yeah, there's some more lockers up there. Uh, there's a military drive. Then there's a bunch of Maryland's. Shotguns. Some ammo, rope, gold nugget. There's a broken gas mask up there as well. Oh, he can't do the jump. There's the claim flag though, so I'm gonna break it. Oh, it was one shot. Good. <laughs> So now we can sh now hopefully now we should be able to place ladders. I'm going to salvage it. Yeah. Area's not claimed. Very good. Alright, yeah, we need to salvage that broken gas mask, obviously. Alright, we'll re-salvage this ladder. We'll place it right over there. I'm gonna salvage another one. Because with one ladder it's actually quite annoying. Now I'm I probably need to go back to base and craft another C4 or bring the Brenter with us. Alright, we'll go up here. Now I'll salvage this ladder and we'll place it up there now if we jump and perhaps press f yeah never mind no it's too far away <laughs> i'll right, place it right over there now i should hopefully be able all right this is actually quite annoying to get up here all right yeah we're up good now i want to get that gas mask more than anything yeah there's some ammo up there as well all right i will probably go back to base soon as well get myself the brente and craft the other c4 yeah i got the gas mask let's go all right i am back we're gonna place the broken gas mask on the floor We'll wear the vest. Now I'll get myself the Brenter. We should have more ammunition of that gun all around the base. I'll take a grenade, the gunpowder, the other gunpowder, Lotus, and I should be able to make another C4. Let's go. Brenter ammunition right over there. Two more boxes, uh, and we should be good to go. I'm pretty sure with five Brenter shots we can raid a wooden wall. I don't know how much it takes for lockers, but hopefully we have enough. Yeah, I have to wait another minute to TPA to my jojo that's okay though we will wait hopefully my jojo doesn't die all right we are back i'm gonna use the brent here now i am i'm going to unbox there's 10 bullets in each box and after each shot we have to reload so it's gonna take us a while second shot At the same time i want to count how much shots it takes for one scrap locker oh okay well three shots that's not that much this locker has grenades copper coil two grenades that's that's pretty nice three shots is actually not that much all right, one more bullet and it will break. And this one, dressing. There's a Polaris Rose over there, 5.56, grenade. And I have 40 shots in total. It's actually, we have quite a ton. We should be able to have enough to raid this whole base, actually, just with the Brenter. 
All right, this one has another Polaris flower, grenade, 7.62 crates. All right, last locker up here, and then we'll move on to the other rooms. Oh, this one, one shot. Oh, 12.7 millimeter. That's pretty good. That's 10 more shots. There's Bevlar down there as well. All right, my JoJo's gonna check out what there was at the bottom. Now, I don't know if I should use a C4 for this, or if I should go in with the Brenter. I think with the C4, it's better. Because if there are lockers back there, then they will be damaged as well. Oh, well, I kind of ruined it. And I broke my leg. That's okay. I will just make a splint. I will take the gold nugget. We can buy ourselves some items with that. Alright, we have to claim this. And now we will jump off. We didn't break our leg good. Now, I don't think it actually did break though. I think we need to put some renter shots in there. Yes sir, it didn't break. Right, hopefully it will take us like a couple of shots only. Alright, so the first 10 shots are out. We had to unbox another 12.7 crate. Alright, yeah, this one is actually quite strong. This is the fourth shot. I'm scared that people are gonna try to count. Oh, we're through. Some blockers. Yeah, there's a bed as well. It's claimed. Alright, one more shot and this one will be able to break. Alright, it broke. Uh, Kinney, gunpowder. That's pretty good. If we get gunpowder, I'm happy with it. Alright, my Jojo spotted the person. I don't, I'm not gonna push though. He needs to push us. Since I have quite a ton of raising gear on me. Yeah, he's sneaking up. Oh, my Jojo's gone for him. Alright, Majojo got him. Let's go. Good job. Oh, he has some military gear. I don't think Majojo looted him though. Alright, we'll check it out later. I right know this is more important. Alright, this broke. More guns. Gun oil, blowtorch, tape. Merlin. Merlins are actually quite good for PvP. Or like one shot headshot. Alright, we'll unbox another crate. This one broke. Uh, industrial copper coil. That's pretty good for us for copper coil. There's a. Uh, 556 five, drum. There's a lot of ammo. There's two balls, walnut. Yeah, this base is not too bad. There's a lot of PvP items in here. More than anything. This one broke. And, um, yeah. Some more guns, honestly. And ammo. Alright, final shot. Never mind, we need one more. And this one had more guns. There was an instructor, Kinney. Yeah, nothing too good from the locker. Alright, now we will raid this wall, because there might be another room in there. We'll unbox this 12.77. Yeah, last one took us like, almost a full box to go through. Well, this raid was definitely better than the first one that I did solo. That one, literally all I got was a roll of fiber. Alright, we're through. Oh, okay. Well, it looks like we only broke the room for the stairway. Nice. Alright, well, we're done from this raid. Not too bad. In order for us to progress, for more raids, we need more gunpowder. So, we will probably head to the dead zone very, very soon. No well, salvage items we do not need. I'm gonna take every single weapon in here, salvage them. So that we get ourselves a ton of metal and we can make ourselves more lockers. Because our base is already starting to get a bit cramped up. Alright, actually, let me check what this dude over here had. Uh, okay, Retro Snake, Kinney. Military clothes, nothing else. Now, actually, since we're here and I do have still a couple of renter shots, we should be able to raid this part. It's made out of wood anyway. Jojo did say that it is a garage, but I will still give it a look. Just in case it is not. I'm pretty sure it takes five shots to raid a wooden wall. We already put in three. Right, four shots. Come on, man. Give me something good. Fifth shot. Right. Oh, yeah. Crates. Four crates. Uh, Jackhammer drive. Detonator. Jackhammer Merlin. Alright, well, there's some loot. I will take the drive, the jackhammer, some meds, ammo, detonator, that's pretty nice. A bunch of junk, some food, GPS, some attachments. Alright, next I will raid the one below us. We got ourselves, damn, so much attachments. Fully decked out this Brenter as well, but I will definitely not use this for PvP. Yeah, I'm currently dying of thirst. Do I haven't even have any food. Yeah, I have a, I have a sandwich. Yeah, this one has a metallic doorway, so perhaps there's some good loot up here. I already put in three shots. Four. This one should break it. I overthrow. Yeah, there was. Wait. Oh, yeah, it is a garage. Oh, he was right. All right, I'm going to home. We did get a drive from here. Some more guns, some more ammo, another detonator. Obviously, we didn't profit. But hey, it's better than nothing. All right, we are back in base. I don't know, but I think next step is for us to go either do some PvP, try to get loot that way, or do a gas mask. Oh, there's an observer here. Easy, cyan crystal. Let's go. W. Yeah, we're right next to the truck. 
We're gonna try to look for people actually. I'm gonna put the Sign Crystal in here already. We'll put that there so if we die, it will still be in there. Anything. 556. Five, this dude just came up in front of me. Hello. No shots. That's close to my Jojo. No, my Jojo's dead. Oh, he left him at 14 HP. Alright, no, no worries. I will kill him. He's right there. He's dead. Alright, let's kill the zombies. Alright, anything good? Let's accept Jojo's TPA. Night Vision Grill. He didn't have anything good though. I will take the gun just in case he comes back. It wouldn't be on the ground. We'll take the metal as well. Some ammo. We'll take the clothes. Actually, I will take everything and I'll just salvage it. Except the night vision though, obviously. Alright, usually mega zombies spawn here, but it seems like there's nothing. I think somebody died up here as well. Yeah, there's a bunch of random junk. Yeah, grit. Or maybe he killed somebody here earlier. And just didn't take the loot. I don't know. Oh, shot. Oh, it's the same guy. Okay, my Jojo got him. Go on, lad. Do you have anything? I mean, he just came back. Oh, he just left the server. Oh, he had a grill. Yeah, he has a base closed then. Alright, boys. So, I'm going to make a filter. We're going to go to a dead zone run. And after that, we'll do a gas mask as well. Trying to find metal. Oh, there we go. Sheets. Last dead zone run didn't end too well, unfortunately. There was a guy on top of the roof. This time, we will make sure that we will go through a different entrance. But yeah, people build bases close to the dead zone as soon as they hear shots. Oh, shots next to my base now. They will just get on instantly on the roof and try to snipe you out, which is exactly what happened last time. Yeah, somebody's shooting very close. I'm not gonna bother, though. Yeah, we gotta salvage some items because we ran out of metal. Alright, and we got ourselves a can, filter, gas mask. We'll do exactly like last time. I will go in, my Jojo will cover. We don't need to be two guys in there. Let's reload. Got myself enough ammo, hopefully, to kill all of the zombies. Yeah, my Jojo's very, very close. Oh, well, he's right next to the base that we that we got sniped from. That's alright. All right, as soon as I am done from here, I will home or I will TP8 to my Jojo. Hopefully, we get ourselves a ton of gunpowder there. Alright, first dude, drop Bevla. Oh, my gas mask is almost out. Uh, this is very bad, actually. I could die from toxicity. So, trying to kill as much zombies as possible. And I hear shots in the background. I'm just gonna run away, man. I don't wanna die. I did get myself, like, three gunpowder there. I still gotta check because I'm not entirely sure. Yeah, we're out of the dead zone. Good. We got ourselves four gunpowder there. That's uh, equivalent to 2C4. Not too bad. Now, I did get myself a bunch of plates, a bunch of bevlar, a bunch of ammo. Yeah, a bunch of gun oil. Not too bad, not too bad. Hopefully with these two C4 that we are about to make, we will actually profit heavily. Alright, well, we hear people killing the electric boss zombie in there. Usually they do jump out from out here afterwards. It's like the only way they could get out. Gold nugget. So we're gonna give them an ambush. I have no idea where I'm going to hide and I have no clue. They actually do come out. I hear them move around in there. It's more than one guy, definitely. So, Leo did join. You guys remember I did defend Leo's base from against the duo. Fortunately, after that, he did get actually fully raided, so he doesn't actually have anything. Yeah, there are two guys in there. Yeah, I hear them jump around. I think my Jojo is gonna go from behind them. Oh, I hear them shoot. Yeah, 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 they're up there then. They just shot the display glass for a Retzel snake. Bro, I'm terrified. <laughs> are they gonna come out or what? Yeah, I hear them move around. Oh. Leo just moved. Hopefully they didn't hear that. Oh. Alright, got them both. Let's go. Alright, that was a perfect... Oh my god, they're stacked. Three military drives, broken gas masks, a billion weapons. Jesus. I'll take the gas mask. They have a lot of weapons, bro. Look at this. Moses. They have Polaris roses over there. I see that as well. Grenade launcher, rope, armored plates. They have four rattlesnakes, five rattlesnakes. Why do they need so much? Oh, here. Oh, that's my Jojo. Yeah, they go up from behind them, actually. But I managed to kill them both. Aha. Yeah, they will take the dressings, the Moses. That's a really, really good weapon. Copper coil. Two tactical lights. Damn. Yeah, I'm happy with that ambush. All right, we will continue moving around before they come back. I don't think they have a base, though. Judging from the amount of loot that they had on them, it's impossible to get that much items from one place. So, they don't probably don't have a base. Alright, so I am back in base, I am placing every single item. And we did find another small base that we can raid, so we're gonna give it a try. It's very small, it's wooden. 
Uh, hopefully there's gonna be some items in there though. This was well hidden too. Later on I actually can make myself another lotus from this dude that I just killed. Well, that's pretty good. You've got so much roses in here. <laughs> you got four flowers in just this one locker. Alright, insane base rate time. Anything? Well, some crates. This one has a floor, nothing. Okay. Yeah, this was a, a very bad raid. There's literally nothing in here. Oh yeah, this was the worst raid in Polaris. So now. Alright, so I just found this big boy base. We're gonna give it a try. Maybe if we can get on top of the roof, then we should be able to raid from the top to the bottom. Because usually that's where the loot will be. Alright, so my Jojo did manage to get up there with his glide there. Uh, I'm gonna place a C4 right over there. It should be one for wood. So we should be good with this one, C4. Oh, I didn't claim it. Nice. Alright, insane base raid. Now we are through. Looks like uh, we raided into absolutely nothing. Nice. Alright, so I'm gonna use the Brent here. It'll take five shots. But I don't want to raid through the metal right now. That was in the literally middle. So maybe on the outer, there's gonna be some items. Hopefully it's just not a layer of honeycomb. Alright, final shot. Oh yeah, we're through. Um, Lotus, let's go. There's a uh, berries fertilizer. There is a bunch of farming in here, actually. These guys are farmers. Oh yeah, we literally raided the one we didn't want to raid. Alright, with that one Lotus, I can probably make myself another... C4 back in base. Alright, so I'm not sure if I should put the C4 or use the Brenter for this one. I don't know how much shots it will take with the Brenter since it's an armored display locker. Or I'm gonna use the Brenter though. So that the C4 will use it if there's a moss of lockers. Hopefully it won't take as much. It'll probably take like 5 shots though or 6 shots. I should have enough. And I still have another box back in base anyway. So we'll just get that later. Wait, what is this? Oh, you can harvest metal? Wait, what? Metal chunks. Okay, I had no idea that was even a thing. No, oh, okay, broke. Um, okay, two roses, false chair. Two false chairs. Cyan crystal, I can make another lotus with that probably. That's pretty nice. Alright, blowtorch. Burrito. Alright, so I placed the C4 over there. Hopefully something good. Uh, okay. Oh yeah, there's a bunch of gunpowder there. Another false chair. Alright, we raided over there as well. I will take all of this gunpowder. Let's go. Very epic. It's like, how much? Like 4C4, bro. That's crazy good. Alright, I'm gonna raid this locker next. Maybe they got damage from C4. I don't think I actually placed anywhere near them, to be honest. Yeah, my Jojo got another Brenter from that. Oh, um, bread. Okay. A bunch of loaves of... Alright. Hey, at least we won't starve to death now. Bro, this trade actually... The gunpowder was pretty nice, but other than that, yeah, I still have one more 12.7mm box, and I did see a locker at the second uh, floor, so we will raid that next. I, I, I still gotta wait to home, though. Oh yeah, this is the locker I wanna raid. It's an armored one as well. And I'm still happy with this amount of gunpowder that we've gotten. If this one is full of gunpowder as well, then I'm gonna be happy. Alright, final shot. Yes, sir, and... Um, okay. Hey, that's pretty... A uh, Goss Mask. That's, uh, that's really good loot. Two mercenary helmets, crazy. Bunch of money, fully decked out weapons. Alright, that's... Sentry Engine. So many people ask me where do you get Sentry Engines from. Um, and I think the only way to get it is from airdrops. That's the only place I've ever found them. Alright, I'm actually not too disappointed with this raid. We got ourselves another full inventory. Yeah, I'm stuck in here as well. I gotta wait, like, five more minutes to home then. Yeah, I broke my leg. <laughs> Alright, so after that we did home and I did leave for the day. And that is also the end of this series. If you guys do want to see more in the future, let me know in the comment section below. I hope that you guys did enjoy this Vanilla Plus Survival series. If you guys do want to play on the server, everything will be in the description below. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. I really hope that you did enjoy and I will see you in the next one. Bye!